if you were going to put a music school anywhere, uh, you wouldn't put it in this location because you have a, a, um, a mainline train station with all the goods, goods trains, trams, uh, buses, taxis, right on the doorstep. What we did was establish the brief. Um, you've got three constituent parts. You've got the, the music school, the academic school, and the performance spaces. And what we did is we put the, all the performance spaces on a ground floor datum and, uh, and below, which sunk down into a, a six metre slope of the site and then lifted the, um, the rest of the school up into the air and then separated that between the music school and the academic school. The expression of the building was to make it as, feel as permanent and solid and monastic in, in, in feel, to give it a sense of security and permanence, but also establish it as, um, as, a, as, a, as, a, as a carved out of the solid form. Um, and you can see that runs through from the external ex, uh, appearance to the, the internal environment with the deep reveals of the windows, which are somewhat similar to the medieval buildings, um, but yet in a, in a contemporary um, manner. We, we were really keen to go down right to the detail, so from the, you know, the choice and the development of the bricks down to um, uh, door handles and furniture. We, we designed, designed our own uh, door handle, which has sort of references to the form of the building and, and musical instruments. And also um, um, there was, um, th there was a, a bespoke bench that, uh, that we designed, um, which was actually uh, one of the trees that was on site that was chopped down. The ambiance inside the building is, is, um, is something which uh, we're quite keen not to make it too institutional, but, um, but really create these spaces for interaction, uh, and mainly the, um, the, 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 the large atrium stroke foyer space, which is this triangular shaped space in the centre of the building, um, and with the terrace levels on the, on the upper levels. Um, which sort of you, know, you can see over into different spaces, but it doesn't look too, doesn't look like an office, doesn't look like a, a, a train station concourse, which it could, all too could have been if we'd have put a, a solid glass roof over the top of it. So we designed these um, north lights and made them very, very sculptural, so it looks more akin to the whole form of the building itself. We had to completely acoustically isolate all of the um, performance and teaching spaces. So they're all box-in-box -box constructions, which are basically a building within a building. And that goes down from the, the, the large, the concert hall and recital halls, all the way down to the, um, to, the, to, the, to the small teaching practice rooms. But what that helped us do was to create these really deep reveals because it created deep reveals on the windows, but also for the doors. So it was quite interesting in terms of the experience when you walk down the corridors, you don't see the doors, you see these big carved openings, which is something similar to what you get in, in the medieval buildings.